Hello everybody, thank you for joining me. This is Game God Fluent bringing you episode 9 of Let's Play Swords and Sorcery Underworld. Alright, let's get the uh, volume correct. So, I'll go ahead and load episode 8 here. So, we explored quite a big chunk of this, but there's quite a big chunk left. So, let's just go ahead. We rested. Let's go ahead and uh, get into it. Got an arsenal here. Um, I guess we're done with this area. Under this door, and we come down here. Um, we can come up this way, and this is new. And that takes us back here, and we can go through this door here. And quick save. not find anything. Oh, it's down here. Okay, three apparitions. Galorian, Sashani, and Laura. Okay, so Grimsby's gonna have to slice an apparition. Apparition is not in melee. Okay. Can you drop out of melee? Paul, go ahead and fight an apparition and miss. Catla, Ice Bolt on an apparition. Sashani, Purify an apparition. Inflicts forward damage. Armored Skeleton orders to move forward. Deafening Fear onto Paul. Laura can kill the apparition. Grimsby can attack the skeleton and kill it. Catla, I guess, can shoot the skeleton and do nine damage. Sashani can maybe kill it. Nice. Three damage. Alright, so what I wanted to do, Laura missed. Um, attack. Shoot it. Shoot it. Laura kills. 56 XP, 26 gold, 6 runes to memorize. Wanted to put back on the padded helm. do a padded helm padded helm scale helm and give the scale helm to Paul because since she's wearing the Wraith Bane I think it'd be better off for him to have the uh, extra protection let's go ahead and function save all right so um, I guess it's time for this encounter. Let's go ahead and try it. Nice cold draft overtakes the party. A deathly voice whispers, I guard, you fall. Okay. So, attack. Six damage. Hide. Shoot. Three damage. Three damage. Um, Arcane Bolt, 33 damage. Read mine. Largely immune to damage, this ancient being found purpose and salvation from an eternity of wandering by pledging fealty to a greater demon and damned itself further. It is undead and ethereal, and it can drain life and regenerate. It does not have a strong weapon, though, but it does have 190 health. Oof, and it just belted us and regen, huh? How are we supposed to do this? Is it gonna do that every turn? Yeah. So I don't think we have any way of defeating it at the moment. Hmm. Never went through this door. That's interesting. Unless maybe we fall back? Or 
go up a level and get new spells. Wicked head. Attack. Hide. Shoot. This thing has a lot of health too. And arcane bolt it. And purify it. Paul falls, 61 damage. Hit for 28. Assassinate it. Shoot it. Shoot it. Heal Paul. Wicked head falls back. Uh, we can just shoot it from here. Shoot it. Assassinate it. Ooh, nice. 58. 338 XP, 225 gold, and 3 runes to memorize. Huh. Oh, there is a door here. Let's go ahead and quick save. And yet another arsenal. Alright, let's try to maybe pull the levers and see how that goes. Let's go ahead and quick save. Yes, a mechanism is set in motion. Hmm. And then go to the other side. Yes. Mechanism is set in motion. Huh, I see an area I haven't been though. Down up here. Wicked head attack. Hide. Shoot. Attack. Arcane bolt again. And purify. Paul falls. Attack. Assassinate for 39 only, but shoot. Um. Oh, you're in melee, so go ahead and a burning hand for 15. You're in me. Uh, no, you go ahead and heal Paul. Paul goes down again. Okay, Laura fights. Assassinate. 338, 150 gold, and three runes to memorize. Let's go ahead and heal Paul twice. Oh, the arsenal opened. Amidst the rubble and debris, Laura finds leather armor and 22 gold. Oh? Oh. Lots of apparitions. Laura and Paul go down. Drop out of melee. Rolorian, shoot an apparition. <laughs> Katla, go ahead and ice bolt an apparition. Sashani. You drop out of melee. They don't know what to do. They don't know what to do. Strikes Laura for four. Undecided what to do. Alright, Laura's back. Attack him. Shoot that skeleton. Shoot that skeleton. Attack. Shoot that one. It's undecided. Order suppress forward. Hits Laura for three. Oh, two armored. Lorian, shoot. Grimsby, shoot. Paul, misses. Sashani. Oh, Sashani falls. Dang. 100 XP, 56 gold. She can't use them, so she can give a magic salt. <sighs> and first aid herself. <sighs> and, uh, okay, the party order's okay. Quick save. Um, anything here? No. So these arsenals 
Are they all open? Um, go this way. Oh, nothing is found. So not all the arsenals have stuff. We found a leather armor though. Plus eight armor. It worked for some wild animal, but not enough. Twelve armor. Um, I'd go ahead and give it to Grimsby, I think. Plus eight armor, plus four armor. Let's go ahead and give it to Grimsby. Uh, let's continue. the rubble and debris Laura finds a spike shield and 32 gold a spike shield a heavy round shield with spikes for offensive side inherent plus five damage that I'm going to give to um Paul he could use the damage that'll be it let's go ahead and quick save I guess all the arsenals are open. Laura finds an amulet of doom and one gold amidst the rubble. The word doom is conspicuously carved on a poorly polished piece of black coat tied to a leather bind. Kids these days. Hmm. Okay kids these days <laughs> um does this okay no you can't let's head out of here oh wait how do I get over there um I can go through this door this arsenal. Laura finds a frayed night shield and seven gold. Finding all kinds of stuff. A humorously imprinted shield that reads, be frayed. Plus one armor minimum strength one. Hmm, I guess I can give that to you. Oh, you can't use it? What class is only for a knight? Oh, frayed knight. Um, is a name of a game, frayed knights. Uh, another indie RPG. Um, how do I get to these arsenals? Over here, okay. Laura finds a great sword and 43 gold. A great sword. Plus 5.5 minimum strength, 16. Heavy, sharp, and fearsome blades stay behind the hill. 10 penetration, my goodness. For some reason, I, maybe it was a bug or maybe it was as, as intended. But I could not level up her strength past 10. Laura finds a pylum in 9 gold. Pylum, an advanced pike, sturdier, sharper, more maneuverable, a gift from the ancients. Reach plus 1, plus 2 times base damage, penetration 3, value 75 gold. The pylum could be for uh, Paul. Yeah, that's definitely a big upgrade. Wow, these arsenals are really paying off. All right. Um. Let's check this arsenal up here. Laura finds a scythe in 15 gold, so a regular scythe. Ingenious multi-directional weapon, three penetration, two times base damage. Well, we already have an ornate scythe, so... Laura finds a plate helm in 17 gold. 
plus 9 armor, minimum strength 12. Best head protection available, especially appreciated by the self-aware. You don't have 12 strength, you have 10. Okay, we'll keep that in our back pocket. Arsenal finds a leather helm in 21 gold. Plus three armor. Some head protection with best peripheral vision but causes sweating and baldness. This is plus two armor, so let's go ahead and give that to her. Leather helm. Yes, it is. Arsenal. Paul finds chain boots and 17 gold. Plus five armor. A bit on the heavy, noisy side. Um, your armor's 29. Hers is 15. Go ahead and give them to... Oh, Laura has to give him the padded helm. And... Paul can give him her the chain boots, which he can wear. Put the plate helm up here. Her armor is now 20. Okay. There was an arsenal down here, right? Laura finds scale boots and 14 gold. High flexibility and low weight for reduced speed and accuracy hindrance. Intricate fabrication. Four armor. Grimsby? You can't use them because of... Oh. Knight, Paladin, Archer. Let's give them... Eh, he doesn't have six strength. Well, Paul could use them again for now. They are on the front lines after all. Laura finds a longsword and 26 gold. Standard infantry weapon, 6 penetration, 150 or plus 1.5 base damage. Better penetration than the pylum. Double the penetration, but not the reach. Um, you don't have the strength to wield it. Ugh. Strength is coming at a premium, it seems. All right, let's head up here and... Oh, we haven't been down there yet. Let's come up here. Laura finds a chain helm in 19 gold. Good head protection without hiding that great smile. She can go ahead and wear that. Leather helm. Can Grimsby have five strength? He does. Plus three armor. Oh, he's got plus three armor. So let's give it to Paul for now. Oh, he's got the scale helmet. Um, your oh, your strength is five. Relorian, so you can go ahead and use the leather helm. Oh, he's got the wooden hood. So it's not necessary. One more point of strength, and Grimsby can use the longsword if it's if it's usable by uh, thieves. Nope, not usable by rogues. Oh, we've been to that one. Into this one. 
Laura finds a flame bur a flamberge, flamberge and 24 gold, flamberge. Two-handed longsword with razor spikes, plus three times base damage, nine strength, penetration six, penetration five plus four, and it is two-handed, so he'd have to give up the spike shield, which is eight armor. for his attack to be mm, plus three times base damage with double the penetration. Less reach though. We'll stick with what we're using, I think. I don't want to go too all out offensively. Laura finds a black oak staff and 19 gold. Finally something for a caster, maybe? Dense wood from the Outer World Forest makes a heavier impact. Reach plus one, 2.5 base damage, spear at plus one. Looks like good for Sashani, minimum strength six. So even casters could have some strength, it seems. Laura finds a scudum and 21 gold. I think that's a shield. Long and rec large rectangular shield, inwardly concave. Archers can rest them vertically on the ground and use it for cover while shooting plus 12 armor. Wow. We're making out like bandits here. So this isn't a monster place, necessarily. This is an old abandoned barracks that monsters made um, their home in basically I think finds a flail in 32 gold a flail centrifugal deadliness raining iron on the ill-advised aggressor 1.75 base damage and it's one-handed minimum strength 7 Alright, now time for us to come down here and explore more. Let's go ahead and make a proper save for episode 9. Let's come through here and how do we get to those bottom rooms? Through here? Counter. Wicked head. Let's find it. Missed. Hide. Shoot for 5. Attack for 14. Mm. Arcane. 42 damage, Sashani. Just shoot. Oh. Paul fell. Not in her hands, though. 30 damage. Assassinate. Missed. Remains unseen. Shoot. Shoot. Heal Paul. Paul falls again. Laura hits for 26. Grimsby assassinate for 31. Shoot. It should fall back now. I don't want to risk shooting it with these two. Let's go ahead and heal Paul again. Paul goes down again. But now we can probably kill it. Missed. Grimsby remains unseen. Heal Paul again. Down goes for Lorian, okay. Missed. 338 XP, 138 gold, and three runes. Let's go ahead and heal Lorian. Um, nothing is found. Nothing is found. Arsenal. Paul finds a longbow in 29 gold. Nice. The woodsman's best friend. Minimum strength 7. So Valorian does need more strength to wield that, but that's going to make his 
attack go way up. 15 penetration. Okay. Sure. No? There'll be an encounter somewhere down here. There it is. Okay, no apparitions. So we can find the armored skeleton. 41 damage. Can shoot a regular skeleton. Can shoot a regular skeleton. Ball can hurt that one. Catlet can shoot that one. Sashani can shoot that one. Miss. Oh, skeleton missed. Falls back, moves to the front. Warren killed. Grimsby can shoot that one. Warren shoot that one and kill. 108 XP, 60 gold. And here we have an arsenal. Paul finds a warhammer and 11 gold. Heavy, large, wicked. 3.5 base damage, minimum strength 12. So that kind of tells us what we should be, what type of stats we should have for being down here, kind of. Alright, let's quick save and attempt this encounter. Oh, well, there is no encounter. Hmm. And this is just a whole new floor. Huh. Beware of this place. The help you seek is further along, to the west. Hmm. To the west, you say. This would be to the east. So this would be to the west. Let's see what's in the middle first. Nothing. Locked. Successfully turned. Oh, succubus charms Laura. What? Hide. Shoot. Okay, it doesn't have much health. Okay, for 27. We gotta kill this thing ASAP. Oh no. I'll read its mind. It's not undead, it's not ethereal, that's interesting, it's not undead, capable of removing any hostility towards her from an opponent's heart, and then some, will readily call lackeys to do the dirty work, summons a demon mistress, attacks with a time six weapon, there's the demon mistress, barges into melee, let's go ahead and assassinate the demon mistress, Rolorian shoot the succubus, Paul fight the succubus, <laughs> Katla, Arcane Bolt, the Demon Mystrix, Sashani. Do we have your PCR? No known information. Uh, I. Mm, well, go ahead. 120 HP, three times weapon. Not undead? The lore of demon kind gathers a rather extensive following amongst those outcasts and seeking a sense of purpose and belonging. Oh, they are. Not undead. And by the way, Laura's charmed and she doesn't even act, so she doesn't attack us. 368 experience, 118 gold, and four runes. Oh, something caught Grimsby's attention. A grim rock. A grim rock. <laughs> For Gr Legend of Grimrock. A rock of grimmer aspect than usual, so much so that it caught the eye and transported your leader's thoughts to a faraway prison dungeon. It acts as a reminder to all of the privileged to have entered the darkness of their own free will. All of the privileged to have entered the darkness of their own free will. Miscellaneous. Hmm. Okay. Um. So let's go ahead and save. So there's nothing that way to the west. Let's come down. Hmm. Let's go ahead and quick save. 
Oh, we should rest though, right? Everybody's out of spell points. Um, can we use it? No, there's zero. So just, I guess, discard them. Let's go ahead and use one. And rest. 42 and 42 remain. Save as episode 9A. Let's see how long we've been playing. 30 minutes. We can play a little bit longer. A door. Hmm. Oh, to a big space. We'll just explore the perimeter. Oh, two apparitions, a wicked head, and a hunting corpse. My goodness. Paul and Relorian are in fear. Laura, only blessed characters can physically harm the undead. <laughs> we forgot to bless. But I can at least come back in here. Um, that's the last of our holy water. Oh, we can make some. Make... Five. Um, save. And we gotta do this again. I think there was an encounter here. It's not there anymore. All right, let's head into the fray. Demon Mistress cleaves with the delight at prospect of fresh blood and a hellish... Wow, Grimsby Falls. Do we know of them? No, and what's the hellish worm? Okay, Laura, fight them, I guess. Lorian, shoot the hellish worm. Paul, fight. Atla. Small Sun on Demon Mistress. Small Sun must be on cast on monsters outside of melee range. So let's see what happens if we cast it on the Hellish Worm. 24 damage, okay. Sashani. Can you purify? Oh, we're in trouble. This Hellish Worm petrifies Grimsby. And they're rocking our world. So what we have to do from here on out, unfortunately... Wait. We don't have anything that cures petrification. So what I think I'm going to do... Wait, load the quick save. Oh, it's even further back is maybe, ha I hate having to run out of here, but returning to town to level up, perhaps, or maybe continuing down this way. I'll go a few more minutes. And that goes into a big, big black hole of a whole new map. that door. There was another door, though. Wasn't there? Yeah. Okay. Let's explore. Counter. Two hellhounds. Okay, they shouldn't be too tough. Oh, when we miss, though. Shoot hellhound. Hellhound. Laura dies. Okay. So we may just have to head back to town at this point. How heckish is that going to be? Um, where did my door go to? Oh. 
How do I get out of here? We can actually fight this. Um, get that apparition miss. Get that apparition. Wait. Burning hand on you. It's the Shawnee. Fight you. Misses, misses. Aiming for Grimsby. Let's go ahead and... Wow, only 8 damage? 27. Oh, she must be, uh... Diseased. Damage absorb armor. Inflicts 3 damage. Inflicts 12 damage. Shoot. There we go. 101 XP, 6 memor- 6 runes. Um... Did my door disappear when I came in here? Because how do I get out of here? Oh. Okay, let's see how bad it's gonna be to have to go back to town. Oof. Let's at least try to get back to town. Pass, pass. Move to the front, barges into melee, undecided. Two hundred thirty XP, a hundred gold. Hmm, it's actually not as tough as I thought to get out of here. But then I have to go. Bear with me, guys, for a second. There is going to be combat along the way. Pass. Moves to the front. Hits Paul for one. Damage absorbed by armor. Barges into the melee. Die. 109 XP, 48 gold, 7 runes. So just bear with me, guys. We're gonna see top side here in a second. Ah. Uh, oh, brother. She misses the demons for some reason. Hmm. Not dead. Laura, he fell back though. 77 XP, 49 gold. We have to go and retool a little bit. Let's get our water supply. We're gonna go make more holy waters. Um, how much holy water does she have? 35, going to make the max 5. Um, Laura didn't use any of her holy water. Uh, is anyone diseased? No. Nope. Everybody's good. Whoa. 24 XP, 2 runes. Why was there combat in here? I don't know if when I went in all these houses, if I necessarily checked for items, or did I? I don't remember. I was only checking like the grassy areas. Um, let's hit Myers Wares. Oof, oof, oof. We have 5,700 gold. Nothing that cures... Let's go ahead and get you... This, we can just sell for one gold, I guess. 
Um, let's go ahead and get some snake blood vials and some Southerdale elixirs. Uh, milk's magic salts. Um, we've exhausted everything possible here. Contemplate and boost spirit by two for the day. Sure. We have the gold. Um, is there anything we really want to sell? Not particularly. Before we end this off... Four XP, two runes. Well, you know what? I'll leave it off here and say thank you for joining me. Hope you're enjoying and continue to enjoy. Next time we'll run in here, we'll level up, take our time, do it right, and uh, then we'll plot our next move. It's going to obviously result into going back down into the. Um, catacombs so there's some stuff here with 12 strength there's some stuff for archers he needs two points of strength uh, Grimsby can you use the longsword no only a knight can use the frayed knight what happens if I put it on Hmm, one, one, one. I don't know if it's necessarily anything. Um, but we'll go through this stuff and try to figure out what to use. Looks like a lot of people are getting strength next level. She could use strength too. All three points. But when is she really ever in melee? But it would give her plus one spirit and plus one reach. And replace her walking stick. So, yeah, thank you for watching. Hope you're enjoying. I'm having a lot of fun, obviously. Much love, peace, and joy, guys. And I'll catch you next time with more. Stay cool.